Day two of the Iowa High School Track and Field Championships are underway in Des Moines. Noah Sacco has more from Drake Stadium. Well, the atmosphere was electric for day one at the Blue Oval. More of the same today for day two of the Iowa State Track and Field Meet here in Des Moines. Five state champions from yesterday. We'll see who else grabs gold, starting with classes 1A and 4A. First track event of the day, girls 1A distance medley relay final. Nora Peterson anchoring home the eighth place finish for Alta Aurelia in four minutes, 18.3 seconds. Lawton Bronson showing out in the second heat. Jolie Metz among the pack into the final 400. She gets them the podium spot. Quartet of Addison Smith, Alice Mahoney, Sydney Brower, and Jolie Metz grabs silver in four minutes, 12.8 seconds. Solid start for the Eagles. There's really nothing that we couldn't have done better. I think we all put in the work. And we just made sure that when we got here, we weren't going to leave anything on the track. More 1A girls, 4x200 relay final. Newell found a team of Kinsey Hinders, Mia Walker, Isabel Bardick, and Mary Walker. And it's Walker getting them bronze in 1 minute, 46.5 seconds. Meanwhile, in 4A, Grace Eric anchors home Sioux City East in 1 minute, 43.9 seconds for third. Back to Lawton Bronson for 1A boys now. Leading the charge is Theo Mosman to Dominic Smith. Loudon Grimsley's got a full head of steam in the final stretch. Grimsley gets them gold in record time. Eagles claim the state title in a new 1A state record at 128.70, continuing to leave their mark at the Blue Oval. Our coaches was, were really uh, holding us to a high standard. They wanted us, that they knew we had the capability of beating that record. We sure, we sure did. I cried a little bit, just a little bit, but man, I, it's something you dream of. 100 hurdle prelims now. 1A girls, Alto Aurelia's Allison Watts in a battle with Claire Schrader of Remsen St. Mary's. Watts edges her out to the second place in 15.23 seconds. Schrader .25 seconds behind for fifth overall. We'll see both tomorrow. And another good finish from Sioux City North's Ariana Klein in the 4A 400 hurdles finals. The junior clocking in at 1 minute 6.6 .6 seconds for seventh. And the wheelchair 800 meter. Unity Christian's Eli Horseman finishes fourth, while West Line Xander Rentschler earned silver in two minutes, 31.9 seconds. New PR for Xander and the meet's most heartwarming event. It's great just to hear the support that these fans have and just the fact that they support every other athlete here just like us. In the field, boys 4A shot put. Sioux City East Blake Hogan camp letting off a heave of 51 feet. That's going to earn him eighth overall and ending in the 1A discus. Akron Westfield's Ian Blau earned gold in the 1A shot put yesterday. He'd go two for two today. The junior hurling a winning throw of 161 feet, eight inches on his fifth attempt. New PR by almost 17 feet and now two state titles performing above the pressure. Tons, tons of pressure every day. Nerves, nerves are horrible today, but it gives me a rush, really, and it gives me that edge to really put one out there. Big time performance from Blau. We'll see who else can follow it up in running and track events in 2A and 3A later tonight. We'll have that for you coming up at 10. But for now, from Drake Stadium, Noah Sacco, KCU Night Sports.